Hey everyone, this is Exploring Fiction, and welcome back to another video. So guys, I haven't said anything about this on the channel at all, but recently over the past year, I've been watching The Sopranos for the first time ever. And let me just say right off the bat, it is my favorite television series of all time. You know, I, I don't watch too much TV shows, I'm more of a movie person myself, but far and away it is my favorite show of all time. And the reason I haven't made a video about it yet is because there are a million videos and channels analyzing and theorizing about The Sopranos, and I felt that I had nothing to add, really, and that, you know, my, my video would just kind of be background noise. But that being said, I did want to make this video discussing what I think is the best scene in Sopranos history. And which scene am I talking about? Well, this is a scene from Blue Comet, the 85th and second to last episode from the entire series, The Sopranos. So guys, there will be spoilers ahead, really big spoilers for the series. Uh, so if you haven't seen The Sopranos, you know, I'm not much of a TV guy, but I highly, highly recommend you go watch it. It is an amazing show. But the scene I'm specifically talking about today is what I kind of refer to as the Raging Bull scene, where Tony, Silvio, and Bobby are all sitting together at a restaurant, and the classical theme from the opening credits of Raging Bull you know, comes on in the restaurant, and Tony and Silvio start shadow boxing each other. And why do I think this is the best scene in the entire show? Well, it's already really dark and dreary. I mean, the early seasons of, of The Sopranos, at least to me, looked a lot more colorful than the later ones. And this scene is almost all gray. Like, everything seems grayscaled. And so, the music from Raging Bull kind of adds a flavor to it. But it's still very gray and grim. And you get this idea from, from the discussion between Tony, Silvio, and Bobby that, and, and this air to their conversation that you kind of know that they know they're not all getting out of this alive. And they're, this is their, this is, by the way, their final scene, the three of them together in the entire show. And so in this scene, it kind of feels like you can, feel the palpable friendship between Tony, Silvio, and Bobby, and it really feels like Tony is with two of the very last people outside of his blood family that he can with trust without doubt. And, you know, this moment of fun happens where he and Silvio start shadow boxing, and it, it kind of gives you a little reprieve from all of this darkness that's going on and this cloud hanging over everyone's head, which this episode does very well, might I add. You know, an ominous feeling hanging over everyone's head in this episode. And you just feel this kind of break in all of that as these three guys who, you know, love each other like brothers are getting one last shared moment together before they're off to their potential and probable doom. And so, you know, there are a lot of scenes and episodes of The Sopranos that go a, a lot deeper subtly as well you know they go more straightforward and subtly into the deep aspects of the show and its characters but this scene for me in blue comet with tony silvio and bobby sitting around discussing their plans yes but also just enjoying each other's company one last time really struck me and stuck with me long after i finished watching the show and i think it's just because you see this glimmer of brightness within each of the three characters amidst this really, really dark and dreary ending to the show. And you you know that things aren't going to go well, and they don't. Bobby is shot to death at the end of the episode. Silvio is shot multiple times and put into a coma, for which they say he might never wake up. And Tony has to go into hiding at the end. And we all know the infamous ending of The Sopranos in the next episode. You know, what may or may not have happened to him. And so, you know, the, the classical music from Raging Bull just kind of gives this melancholy 
yet calm feel when they know it's it's basically a, guy, a bunch of guys together sitting around b before they go off to war. And so, yeah, I just couldn't shake this scene from my head, and I just wanted to share my love and appreciation for it, as well as the show as a whole, in, in, in kind of a shorter video, in hopes that either there are some people who think like me about this scene, or I can start a discussion about this amazing TV show. And so that's all I've got for this one, guys. Um, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think about all this. Let me know what you think about The Sopranos in general. You know, this is my first video about The Sopranos, even though I spent a lot of time watching it over the past year. So I'd love to hear what you have to say. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new here. I'd love to have you. And like always, I will see you next time.